and I'm teaching community-led action in a changing climate. I have been working in the field for approximately 15 years and I've been at Cody for three years. I'm really excited about this class because uh, we're going to be joined with participants from all over the world who have a wealth of experience and knowledge and they're seeing the impacts of climate change in their own communities. And what I really love about having people from around the world in the classroom is that we feed off each other, we learn from each other, we learn what's happening in Bangladesh versus India. And it's really exciting for me to watch the participants come together and uh, be excited about the learning that happens, the co-creation of knowledge between the participants. This course is gonna be really great because uh, climate change is a really pressing issue. There's a lot of things about climate change that many people just simply don't know, and why would they if they don't work in the field? So we will start with the science be behind climate change. We will talk about what's happening in everyone's own country. So are people seeing increased flooding? Are there uh, increased intensity of typhoons? How are, uh, ag how is agriculture being impacted? And we're gonna look at these situations and what we find out is that many places, people are facing the same kinds of problems. So it is, there is an ability to problem solve with one another. We're gonna talk about mitigation and adaptation. In many of the countries in the global south, the primary issue is about adaptation because they haven't caused the problems of the greenhouse gases in the atmosphere, but they're going to be most impacted. So we're going to be looking at how we can plan communities to respond to the impacts of climate change and how communities are adapting for themselves. For example, there are people who are living in informal settlements who are having to respond to the impacts of climate change through increased flooding. And in communities where there's already a lack of infrastructure, this is really critical for people to be able to understand how they're gonna cope with the extreme events that are gonna continue to, uh, to impact very vulnerable populations already. Participants will leave this course knowing what climate science is. They'll understand adaptation and mitigation. They'll understand the global policies that impact what's happening on the ground. They'll understand uh, the Green Climate Fund, for example, to understand where money will come from that can help communities to adapt to the impacts of climate change or to mitigate the greenhouse gases going into the atmosphere. They'll understand uh, from other case studies around the world what other communities are doing and they'll understand how they can group together, uh, bring people together in a community to, to respond to the impacts of climate change through adaptation.